In this video, we learn how to install Bravio Server and Gravio Studio on Mac OS X. To start with, Gravio is an edge computing platform that connects to IoT sensors. And if you have sensors such as temperature or contact sensors, occupancy or even buttons, uh, you can connect them to Gravio uh, if you have uh, ordered them via our website gravio.com. So Gravio starts with two things. So it has a server that you install and run in the background of your machine. It can be a, a Linux, a Windows or a Macintosh machine. Uh, and it has a Gravio Studio which is the front end that you, that you need to configure the servers. They don't need to be on the same machine, they can be on different machines, but um, you definitely need both in order to get started. A good start is always uh, in the App Store. So you go to the App Store and you download Gravio Studio. So Gravio Studio. And here we go. Once you've installed it, you can open it. And you can either register or you can log in with your existing account. So now uh, let's start from scratch. So I start with registering a new account. So let's say uh, sign up. So for the next step to log in, you need to verify your email. So what I need to do is I need to go and log in. Cloud. Yeah, I'm going to check my mail. Got the verification code. Copy that. Okay, go to login. Verification code login. And now I'm registered. So this is Gravi Studio. This is what I use to connect to servers. Of course, now we don't have a server yet. So we're going to install a server here on the same computer that I have already running here. So of course, if I had a other computer, a Linux, a Raspberry Pi, or a Windows machine, I could also go and download Gravio server and install it there. But uh, for, for, in, for the example today, we just install it on the same machine here. So I'm going to the website. So this goes to gravio.com slash products. Here you can see uh, the servers. So the servers are available for macOS, Windows, Raspberry, and Linux. So we choose uh, macOS. Scroll down. And then here, download Mac. Drop and click. Blender opens. Drag it into your applications folder. And that's when you're going to have both applications Gravio Services and Gravio Studio on Windows computers. So now let's start the server locally. So I'm going to this. Now, because you have downloaded it from the internet, there are certain security messages that will show up. So you want to open it anyway. So you need to enter the password. And then it asks also, do you want to install the receiver driver? Are you sure? That's so you don't know what works with with your computer. So continue. So install the driver. And that's only 220 kilobytes. And 
then there's another message about the system extension. So what you can do is you can open the security settings. And then you can click on allow here, meaning that you're allowing this driver to be installed. This is a new thing in the more recent Mac OS 10 versions, um, which is good for security. So now it's allowed. Once it's done and you're ready to go, you can see there's already a Gravio server icon at the top here. So you can start the service. It starts the Gravio, so Gravio is now running in the background. Um, what you can do now is you can start Gravio Studio, which we have already before, and then all you have to do is simply click plus to create the server. So you can say load from the server host, that means this computer. If you have an IP address, you would use an IP address. And there you go. This is a server that I have for SSL. You can double click on the server to edit it and also to connect it to the sensors. Um, what you have is you have a USB donor device um, that you can connect. And once you have connected that, and then connect the sensors to it and we will do that in the next video.